What up, YouTube? Thank you for tuning back into the channel. It's your boy, it's your boy. Dave. You reached Tesla Picker. Thank you for tuning in. I'm a little down right now, man. I recorded a whole video, the giveaway video. I actually threw in a little uh, picking, me going to the thrift, you know, just to spice up the video and everything. I get to, you know, trying to edit it and whatnot, and all my files are corrupt. Oh, come on, the man. The video you watching now was probably supposed to, supposed to drop right now as I'm doing it, which is 8.20 in the morning, Friday the 13th. But I'm having to record it again, and I'm going to an estate sale right now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add in the giveaway at the end of this estate sale run. Hopefully, just hopefully, everything will be okay with this video. My God, that sucks. I don't know if anybody done been through it, and I'm sure people have, but you get all this content, you know, you think you got the best video ever about to drop, and then the memory card says, nah, brother, not today. They don't want to see us win. Anyway, I ain't going to let that get me down, man. We're going to run over here. I got this uh, estate sale. I started at 8. It's 8.30. I had to put the kids on the bus, so I couldn't get there right at 8. Um, I seen a couple pictures. Hopefully, um, you know, I, I don't know about this one. I didn't see that many horror. I just seen a bunch of furniture. Hopefully, it's not picked over. I mean, it's first day. It's only going to be a two-day event. So, we'll see. I'm going to get over here and see what's up. There's another one about 30 minutes away that said that... <laughs> They had 90 years plus of collections. Basically, the people who have been there are 90 years and they got a bunch of stuff. But I am not trying to drive, there. it's actually 32 minutes from my house. I can't do it, I just got off work, I worked third shift, I'm tired, I ain't been asleep yet. I said, nah, I'm gonna I'm yes, pass sir. on that. This right here is not too far, it's about eight minutes away, so. I'm gonna get over here and do this, man, then we're gonna do the giveaway real quick, and then I'm gonna go to sleep. All right, so. Um, Let's get over here and see if they got. And I'll see you guys in a few. Very nice house. The house is actually pretty dope. Not much I can see it right now. There we go. Got a picture of the house. Very nice house.
keep going to the right, you know, then you're gonna get there. <laughs> You can see this is out of my neck of the woods. This is actually a very nice house. Look at this. Look at that. Anyway, yeah, man. Uh, that person or uh, those people, they were some high class people. I mean, they had stuff in there. I mean, shoes that cost a hundred to two hundred dollars. They had, you know, um, just all quality uh name brand stuff in there you know what i'm saying and that's pretty much what they had a lot of i mean they had a bunch of jewelry i mean pretty much it was out of my league really you know now you know i'm trying to make a profit some of that stuff i probably could have made a profit but i would have had to pay up and i'm not there yet you know what i'm saying i'll be there one day you know what i'm saying i'm not these big well i'm not great talking about that anyway yeah like i was saying earlier man i'm gonna show you the stuff when i get home Y'all let me know if I made a good deal. I'm going to look at some comps a little bit more when I get home. For some reason, when I go to an estate sale, when I get off work, I done worked a long night shift. I get kind of crazy <laughs> on getting stuff. You know what I'm saying? I need to start taking somebody with me and be like, calm down, Dave. Or I need to go live. 
Don't y'all need to be watching me? Why? E, has anybody did that? I'm sure they have, but I have never experienced that. I'm gonna go live one day on a pick and actually engage with y'all. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? It's my new thing. I'm gonna do that one day. Anyway, I'm gonna get out of here because I don't even know where I'm at. Had to get out of here. It was a nice house, very nice house, and it was a ran by an estate uh, company, and they had price prices were high. You know what I'm saying? Prices were super high. I might come back Sunday. They had so much stuff in there. I might come back Sunday because a lot of people was going right past that stuff. They was not buying. Hopefully Sunday they're willing deal, and uh, they'd be around my range. So yeah, let's go home. All right, I'm back at home. I'm in the basement, the man cave. Um, I'm gonna go over what I got at this estate sale. And then after that, I'm gonna pick the winners for the giveaway. Round of applause. Yes, this is my second time doing it. Bruh. Uh, I had a, if you follow me on Instagram, I post my Instagram right there. You'll get it there before you get it on YouTube. But I recorded this big old nice, like I said in the beginning of the, uh, the video, and it all messed up. So come on, man. I'm back and I'm doing it again. Um, anyway, let's go over what I got. All right. Uh, I really, it's crazy. Like I was saying, I got basically some jackets. I ain't get no hoard goods. And I'm going to show you the jackets I got, man. Uh, first, let's start here. I got this. Um, let me do it like this. My God. I should have been ready, man. Bruh. I got this old LL Bean Mar Marine Guide. Made in the USA. I got it's a vintage type jacket. These people had old but nice stuff, you know. Um, if anybody's familiar with this brand, I'm familiar with AL Bean, but the Marine, oh man, Marine, main guide made, you know, made in the USA. I know it's a vintage type jacket. Let me know, man. If you find any comps, I couldn't find no comps on this. And it's a nice vest slash jacket-ish type deal, all right? Anyway, and I also got the jacket. It's the same right here. Hold up. Bean, same thing. LL, main guy, but it's the jacket. Pretty nice. I'm digging it. I don't know if you can see it. There we go. So, I got that. And these were $6 a piece, man, you... I also got this piece. It's a Ralph Lauren. Uh, I used to pick up Ralph Lauren, but I love this one. This one's a nice vintage one, I can tell. It got that plaid with that plaid collar underneath. Um, that golf polo logo. And yeah, man, this looks pretty nice. XL. I couldn't find the exact comp on this either. <laughs> but, you know, I think I can get a little piece of money for that, man. I'll do a little bit more research later. So I got him. Even though, you know, spring's, summer's coming, I still feel like I can do okay. And last but not least, man, I got this Bell Berry. Uh, somebody was trying to fight me over this one. Not really fight me, but it's like, oh, man, I was a little too late. Because I guess they seen it on the um, the advertisement. But I went on to pick it up. And it's nice. I mean, I'm talking about excellent condition like you never wore it. Um... It's vintage as well. It's like a tan members only looking jacket, but they got the bearberry inside. Uh, if it, you know, got them buttons on the on the sleeve. If anybody's familiar with the, you know, if anybody can find any comps or something, let me know. All right, I know I'll probably end up finding some, but you know, a lot of you people are a lot more. I mean, I know bearberry. I know it's name brand. I know it's popular and high price clothes, but you know, I don't wear Burberry. You know, I just sell it. So, you people who know what y'all know, hit me up and let me know. You feel me? Anyway, last but not least, and I think this is what, I mean, I passed, look, I walked past this thing. I looked at it a couple things. Times was like, nah. It's this calculator right here, okay? Now, the reason why I walked past this is because it was up, it was up in the top shelf. So all I could see was this EC4000 and this. I didn't see Olympia on there, so I thought it was just an old generic calculator, right? So I walked past, walked past, and I don't know what made me do it, but I, I pulled it down, and I was like, oh, this is Olympia. So I looked it up. Look at these comps. 
This calculator is going for a hundred dollars. They wanted ten. I probably gave them a ten. This thing is going for about a hundred bones, easy. And this is an excellent collection, man. Look at this. And, and look, and plus I got paper with it as well. It's an old school vintage. I don't even know what year. Let me see if I can find it. Old school vintage. Uh, I can't find the year, but uh, I found it out later. Um, Olympia calculator slash, whatever that's called. Uh, I plugged it up. It works. It's nice. This one is actually kind of customized. This is uh, up the street from me. Standard typewriters and supply ink. 1702 Borstown Road, Louisville, Kentucky. That's up the street from me. Um, yeah, man. I lucked out on this. I'm glad I looked it up, man. But it, they going for, I mean, one just sold for like $100 yesterday or the day before. So, uh, and there's only like one listed. I think I posted that comp and, you know, maybe five sold. So, this would move real fast. And I'm. this is going to pay for what I paid for everything plus double it's gonna double my money just this alone so these right here are just bonuses bonuses assists bonuses assists anyway that's what i got from the east day sale uh like i said i might go back sunday prices was kind of high on everything that's the reason why i got the clothes because they was okay on clothes so i just got the jackets though i could have got some shirts and stuff but i'm gonna try to mess all that i just got jackets I was done with it even though Spring, summer's coming. People are still wearing jackets, so I'm gonna hurry up and get those listed. But if you do know about that LL Bean main main guide series made in USA, y'all let me know. It's actually uh, made. It's actually um, Primo Loft or something like that. But anyway, time for the giveaway. All right, now I'm doing it now. Let's see, I'm doing it here on the YouTube comment picker. Let's see how many comments I got on that video. Filter duplicate you. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay, so we got wow, 244 comments. I don't know if you can see it. I'm on my GoPro and it doesn't focus. You know how GoPros are. So there is 200 and 244 comments. Wow, that's pretty good. All right, so we're gonna start with the first person, and that person will be. John Straw, he said, Liney sent me over. Love to get me a pair of Liney socks, bruh. He, he, he. Hey, guy, you got yourself some Liney socks. That's number one. You're the first person, so let's pick another one. And if you win, uh, I'll leave my email in the description, or the best way to get me is over on um, Instagram, too. So Instagram or email me. Vintage Junk Hunt. Laugh out loud. Love the socks. Awesome. Hey, Vintage. You got yourself a pair. All right. Wear them proudly or hang them up proudly or do whatever you want to do with them. All right. That's the two right there. All right. Let's pick another one. Let's pick another one, y'all. And we got the winner. The name is just Guy. That's a nice name right there, Guy. Those socks are freaking sweet. Good idea. A nice touch. I did subscribe now. I'm an eBay seller, but don't do the YouTube videos as of yet. Laugh out loud. Hey, guy. Is this name Winner Guy? Bruh. Yeah, his name is Winner Guy. I'm silly. What's wrong with me? His name is Winner Guy. Anyway, Winner Guy, you got yourself some socks. Make sure y'all hit me up. Um, I don't know. I guess hit me up. I don't know. Just hit me up on the email or Instagram. All right, here we go. And we're picking another one. What's this, number four? Number four, let's go. And we got Robin Cherry. Robin Cherry said, fun video, Lonnie on socks. How fun is that? Laugh out loud, ha, ha, ha. Guess you're some socks, girl. Yeah, you. Yeah. Oh, I hope it's a girl. Bruh. Anyway, let's pick another one. Number five right here. Number five. Final. Final one. You know what? I'm feeling good today. We're going to do another one after this. Caleb, the reseller, says, I want them socks. <laughs> Guess what, Caleb? You got the socks. Let's do one more because I'm feeling good. I can't feel too good. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. And the final and last one is, 
<laughs> Look what they name is. They name is Last Pick, so we gotta be done. <laughs> I laugh out, laugh out loud. I get some great stuff on high bid as well. We say always a good time too. Last pick, you was the last pick, and guess what? You got yourself some socks. I'm feeling good now. I got a second win. I don't need to go sleep now. Bruh. Right after this video, I'm gonna be sleeping. So, hey, all you winners, congratulations. Hey, just hit me up. I'll put my email in the description. Or if you feel good with Instagram, it's whatever. I, you know, hit me up and we'll figure out something. Get your address and I'm gonna get them socked out to you. All right, um, I picked six people. Congratulations. Hey, we're gonna do this all the time though, man. Um, Lonnie, the reason why I did Lonnie, as you all know, he was the, he shouted me out, you know, when I, I was a nobody, basically, and he gave me a shout out, and I was just surprised he, I mean, I don't know how he ran up on my video. That YouTube algorithm is crazy, I guess, but, or maybe one of the comments I left, maybe, um, I don't know, I need to ask him that, I don't know, but he shouted me out, man, and, uh, you know, got me a couple extra subscribers, man, and I appreciate that. Like I said, I don't do it for that. Uh, I love doing what I do, and um, it just makes it a little bit more fun, the interaction with people and stuff like that. So I just decided to make something with his face on him, his logo and all that. Like I said, I make socks, and I make different ones, so who knows, I might have uh, something, else up, something else up my sleeve. So y'all be, y'all just stay tuned in, all right? So, but all that being said, I'm gonna get off of here, man. I'm about to go sleep. I gotta edit this video. Like I said about the clothes, if anybody's familiar with that LL Bean, that, that line, but not really the L.L. Bean, just that I couldn't find anything. The main guy, Primaloff line, for some reason, I don't know. So, with all that being said, I'll probably just put it on there for whatever I want to put it on there for. Since I don't see none, guess what? I'm going to throw $1,000 on each piece. <laughs> Y'all be good, people. Peace.